hello lovely blessed fam how you are doing if you are new to my channel thank you so much for tuning in to all my oldies and new i welcome you once again i say a big thank you i do appreciate you your love i never take it for granted we are here to know what this channel is all about this is life of a domestic worker in harab gulf country i'm a house manager and i do make a video pertaining to life of shagara share everything to my experience making cooking video and my lifestyle generally finally it's my boss traditional engagement In today's video, I'll be explaining what all men party means in Oman traditional culture. There is no occasion in Oman without presence of fruits, sweets, desert, and kawa, which is known as coffee. So this is the venue of the occasion. The inside and outside is arranged like this, apart from the dining section, whereby they will be eating after the main engagement party this occasion is the acknowledgments accepting promising and staging of marital vow between the bride father and the groom whereby their relative friends well wisher all male that are very close to the in-law and the groom will be present there and they will be having a discussion for some hours whereby the father-in-law will explain few things about the bride-to-be and also how he wanted the groom to take proper care of the daughter. So that is what the occasion is all about. And after the discussion, the groom will say, yes, I do. I will surely take good care of your daughter. And also, the father-in-law we said, yes, yes, you are not acceptable to me as my son and also as a son-in-law. In the presence of people who witness the occasion, the groom and the father-in-law we exchange handshake and snap some pictures. After that, they move to the eating section, eat, marry discuss laugh and that is the end of the occasion this only happened for just two to three hours and after that they dismissed back to their various home as women is not permitted to see men events the cover where it exposed with white clothes and close the gates during the events Finally, this is item 7. Yeah, this is what they have after the old marital vows exchange and everything. Look at everything. All these trays, all these big pots, coffee, sweets. Yeah, this is what we are serving our guests. You may not get a This is how a lot of Omani madam are overprotective of their image. You wouldn't believe that she's covering this lady's face as if I was doing it without a concert. The lady gave me go ahead. As I said, that someone will be coming to help me out. This is my friend and this is the second time we are working together. I know her. She's a Tanzania girl. So, but the woman that is covering her face she's not even our boss but she's part of the family where the lady is working and uh, she was like la 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 which means no 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 don't record her face and the lady have told me about it that if they see it they won't allow me to do that so we actually pull a prank on them without their consent and they fall into it so i will show you some clip of this my friend making a tiktok video and uh,
It was a very busy day so I couldn't capture where the lady that came to help me were working with me, carrying things, washing, cleaning and do so many things together though they can't go inside our houses because they don't know everything about the house so I have to do most of the things but I enjoy their service. Thank you ladies. God bless you. Africa Shagala, take note of this. A lot of our madam do take us out to help their family member whenever they are holding events. You can decline. If you know that whenever they take you out to work and they don't treat you well or they just see you like thank you and that is all, there's nothing like uh, appreciative about what you did. Don't go out with them. Next time, if they invited them that this other person is holding an event and they will need someone to help out, don't do that. If you know that they are not the kind that support you or try to help out whenever your boss are holding events, you don't have to pay back or necessary thing. Talking from my experience, Ishagala join us later in the evening. She's Bangladesh and you won't believe that these Bangladesh people, they have this their own street policy. Whether they work a lot or not in your event, so far you invited them to come and work, it's part-time job for them. That means you have to pay them the time they will be spending in your house because that is not their assigned house. So what, what are we, Africans, that we will be taking outside all we just hear is thank you or they hardly give us gift depend on the kind of people you work with some of them will just give you a little change but this bangladesh india people if they work with you you are going to pay them a certain amount they will tell you even if whenever they are finished working they will sit a little bit spending their money so please and please just note that don't just go out Tell them you can't. You can see me packing the leftover after the party. So we'll be washing the plates. You can see the rice, the chicken, the bones from the remnant. So we are packing it. And uh, you'll be seeing that Bangladesh that join us later when she's trying to help me clean the houses. And uh, that doesn't mean that she will stay for too long with me. Once it's 5 p.m., which is the time every shagala return to evening work she has to leave so that is my tanzania gay and this is the bangladesh shagala that i mentioned please and please be wise